Okay guys, so in this one, I'm gonna show you how to make a bridge between an Objective-C framework, or maybe you just have Objective-C files or whatever code that you're using. So I'm gonna show you how to do this. Now, I'm gonna be completely honest and admit that I know nothing about Objective-C except for how to do this, and even that is, to be honest, pretty shaky, but I'm gonna show you what to do. So we're using MailCore 2, and it's a Objective-C framework, and we're gonna bridge it to Swift. So one of the things that we have, we're just gonna go into this view controller I have here, and one of the objects in MailCore 2 is the SMTP session. So that MCO SMTP session. So I'm just gonna create that in the view controller, and you, as you can see, cannot find MCO SMTP session in scope. And that's because it hasn't been bridged yet. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna come up to our project and I'm gonna do this just in the normal root directory. We're gonna say new file and we want a header file. So you can search for header. Okay, so I'm gonna call this mail core two underscore bridge. I'm gonna create a now it's gonna create a few things, as you can see, mailcore to bridge underscore h, and, uh, and that's in, in if and def, and then define. So all that we're gonna do, we're gonna line break, we're gonna say hashtag include, and then mailcore.h. So capital M, A I L, capital C, O R E, dot h. And I'll show you what that is. See if I can find it. Found it the other day. Well, we can actually just do, copy that and do a Command Shift O for that file. And as you can see, this is the mail core header file. So I'm not sure exactly how Objective C works, but I assume this is like some kind of exporting kind of thing, or it grabs it. I guess it's headering this. If you have Objective-C or C++ experience, this probably makes more sense to you, but then again, you're probably not watching this video then. So the next thing that we're gonna do, so that is not just gonna work right out the box. If we try to run it, we're gonna see we still can't find this in scope. So we're gonna go into a pro our project and we're going to go to, we're gonna make sure we click on our targets one we're gonna to go to build settings. We're gonna make sure that this all is selected and this combined is selected. And then we're gonna search bridging, B-R-I-D-G-I-N-G. -I and you're gonna see this Objective-C bridging header. So you're gonna double click that. Now, what we're gonna first try is we're just gonna select our bridge and then just come and hold it over this box and paste it. And that should work. So you should get your full path to it. Now this might not work. So we're just gonna exit out of that and make sure that it saved. And we're gonna try to run it and it's not gonna work. So the next thing that we need to do is we're gonna search for our header search. So header space search. And you're gonna see this header search paths one. So double click on that. So in here, we can kind of just guess what's going on. We have inherited, then we have pod root header slash public. Then we have pod root slash header slash public slash mail core two dash iOS. Now, if we go into our navigator and we come into pods and then we go into mail core two iOS, I don't think there's anything else with that name. I don't think so. But if you take a look, we don't have this mail core header one and we want that. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna copy this whole thing. We're just gonna paste and then we're gonna do a slash before the uh, double quote, before the quotes. And we're gonna say mail core. Okay, so close out of that, build it, make sure it's correct, then we're gonna run it. And there you go, just like that, it's actually working. 
So I don't know really what I did, but that is how I have been bridging things. So if you're using a different uh, framework with a bit Objective-C, just try these out. Like the first things you should try is this header search paths, and you should also try the, the bridging. You should also try the Objective-C bridging header and also have your header uh, file. So that is it. Thanks for watching. I hope this helped.